is back to you. Thank you, Raina. 801 and new this morning. Redwood City needs more time, so they are extending their temporary ban on new gun stores. Yeah, the controversial move was actually uh, met with overwhelming support during last night's city council meeting. Crow for Sarah Stinson has been following the story for us, joining us now live from Redwood City. Morning, Sarah. Yeah, good morning. I mean, there's no gun retailers in Redwood City right now, and this debate really started when a few gun retailers applied to open up shop in, for example, this strip mall, Roosevelt Plaza, and that is when people became concerned because this is about a block away from a school, a community center, and that's when the discussion came about where should these gun shops go. So what they did was put a temporary ban on them in the meantime while they figured that out. Originally it was a 45 day ban 45 days expired and last night city council they unanimously approved a 10 and a half month extension on that temporary ban of gun shops council members made it clear last night saying this is not a ban on guns or them trying to infringe on the second amendment rights of people council members and the mayor want to make sure people know that they're just trying to see how and where gun shops can operate safely they want to make sure they're put in in, in a appropriate areas. For example, at this strip mall where I'm at, there's also an ice cream shop where kids frequent, so that's a concern as well. City Council plans to spend the next four months doing extensive research, and they'll be discussing ideas with each other and with the public. The mayor explained why this is so important. Redwood City has adopted a strategic plan that has the needs of youth as a top three priority. Um, so we would be remiss in our duties to the community uh, to not take the, the moment to study the possible safety impacts. Um, given uh, the research uh, that overwhelmingly shows there is significant risk to health and safety. Last night, the debate on gun shops kept being compared to the debate on cannabis shops that they've had in previous years. Now, some ideas that popped up and that they'll continue to discuss is having gun shops be at least a thousand square feet away from a school, a park, community center, a church. That's just one idea, and they'll be discussing more in the coming months. Now, while last night there was nothing but majority of people saying they're in favor of this, we have heard some people concerned with. Oh, uh, we, we just <laughs> lost your signal, Sarah. We'll try and Thanks. reconnect with her coming up in a little bit. But you get the gist. The gist. They need more time to consider the ramifications of issuing more gun store permits. All right. Now let's go to the East Bay and Lafayette yeah. City. In fact, similar.